What's going on guys, Mike O back with another TTM recap episode. Got two returns to share with you today. Really excited to uh, let you know who I got. Awesome returns, great additions to the collection. They're both two of two successes and they are all Allen and Ginter cards, all signed in blue. Makes me super happy, so uh, let's get right into it. Uh, also, both of these did require donations, um, which I'm fine with. They're going to good causes, and they're adding awesome autographs to the collection, and they're done really well. So first up is a two of two success coming in 19 days, and this is coming from the Rocket Roger Clemens. Really excited to get these back. First here on this 2014 Allen & Ginter, signed in blue. Looks amazing. Um, really thrilled to add that sent these to the Roger Clemens Foundation. So he signed that one. And then he signed the 2016 Ginter, also in blue. So that's pretty cool right there. You got Roger Clemens in the Red Sox uniform. It's where I remember him, you know, being so great in, you know, my youth. And then here with the Yankees where he found some success as well. I know Clemens now, you have some people who still love him and you have some people who dislike him. Obviously, he's one of those guys that had issues with steroids and all. But, you know, the guy still won seven, I believe, Cy Young Awards. And, uh, you know, was great on the mound with both the Red Sox, Yankees, and then Toronto and Houston as well. They're beautiful additions to the collection. Awesome looking cards. Really, um, really thrilled to add them. So, very cool. And, you know, Clemens, I just, I grew up in that time where he was dominating on the mound and he was in card products and starting lineup figures and he had his own video game. So, that's definitely amazing. Absolutely slab worthy. The next one is very cool as well. This guy played for a long, long time. Two of two success in 14 days coming from Mr. Carlton Fisk. He has a charity for cancer, so sent him a donation as well. This 2013 Ginter is awesome. Uh, looks amazing. I love 2013 Ginter. Uh, they're just great looking cards. So there you go, there's a nice look at that. We'll go up a little further, see if we can get that to focus in. And uh, beautiful looking card. I have seen some people occasionally get him back without a donation, but uh, you know, I just really, he was one of those guys that I'd been planning on sending to and finally got around to it, so no big deal. And then this is a 2014 Ginter, another beauty, awesome looking card there, so uh, awesome. Big, thick signature, very, very cool. He was two of two in 14 days. I think Clemens donations around $20, $25, and Fisk is pretty pricey. He might be... I think he's around $40 or so, but it goes to a good cause, and I send a check, and, you know, not going to complain about it at all. Uh, you know, if you have access to guys like this, uh, why not get them signed? Why not add them to the collection? And when you start comparing, you know, if you want to get these guys at a show or something, you're going to be paying a lot more than that. So not a bad deal at all. There's another look at the Fisk. Hopefully get it to focus up. Sometimes when you put it too close to the camera, the focus isn't amazing. But there you go, two beauties. So, hell of a day at the mailbox, and two guys who played for the Boston Red Sox. So one last look at the four of them. There we go, two from Clemens, two from Carlton Fisk. I'd say that's a successful day at the mailbox for sure. Guys, comment below, let me know what you think of these successes. Any certain card uh, stand out to you? I think all four are outstanding. Uh, I can't, I don't know if I can pick a favorite. I do like the 2013 and 2014 looks though. So comment below, let me know your guys' thoughts. Hit the like button, subscribe, and I will talk to you guys next time. Have a great one.